Beastmaster on my main account. That is a Beastmaster solo on a solo only Iron Man account. No Corruption Blast, the Elder Wand, no Acto, done. Told you guys it was possible. That's really unfortunate. That's so unfortunate. But, uh, hey, at least we know we can do it, right? While I am still soloing Beastmaster as often as I can and as often as I have supplies, I thought we would shift gears and work on something else at the same time. Eventually, I need to get all of the Elite Dungeon 2 abilities from the Dragonkin Laboratory, but I've done about 25 runs so far and it hasn't been the most pleasant experience. So I want to make that experience just a little bit more fun. And the way that we're going to do that is in ED3. I'm first going to get myself a Salve Amulet, and then I'm going to go do ED3 until I get 100 Blackstone Hearts. Once I've got the 100 Blackstone Hearts, we'll then shift gears to Big Game Hunter and get ourselves 60 refined components, and at that point, we'll be able to make ourselves the Dragon Slayer Sigil. Once I've got the Dragon Slayer Sigil, then we're going to revisit ED2, and we're going to lock ourselves in there until we've got ourselves all the abilities we need. And hey, if we're lucky, we might even get ourselves part of an Eldritch Crossbow. Welcome to Episode 6 of Solo. Okay, so I just got the Guildmaster qualification, and I am going to first buy the Energized Meteorite Shard to get myself the Matic of Time and Space, which should actually be really cool, because that'll be a very significant upgrade, obviously, going from, uh, from a tier 80 all the way to a tier 99 Matic should be a huge boost. I'm still to get that before the outfit, and I don't actually have any more chronos. Okay, that's it. That actually was very quick. I thought that'd be like a warning message or something, but nope. We now have ourselves an augmented Matic of Time and Space. That should help Arc stuff quite a bit. That's really cool. Okay, that is the end of Azanadra's quest. The new spells just came out earlier today, so I'm trying to get these quests done. As always, I'm a little behind the curve on quests. I could have done this weeks ago or even like a month ago. Okay, Battle of the Monolith done. I've got to say, best thing about Battle of the Monolith is that I never have to do it ever again. There it is, quest complete. In the meantime, I wanted something else to work towards that wasn't time locked between a two-day raid lockout. So here's what that plan is. We complete the Haunted Mine quest. So anyway, I'm going to pickpocket you for your key while staring directly into your eyes. That was a disrespectful move. That's like a poster dunk. Poor guy. Didn't even know what was going on. All of a sudden, wallet gone. Keys gone. House gone. Wife gone. Love to see it. And we're done. Haunted Mind quest complete. So we're going to make ourselves nine salve amulets here. I need to figure out what I need to do to enchant them, but that should be very quick. I think we can literally just teleport with a slayer ring and grab the book. Turns out this is actually leaked Elder God Wars dungeon footage. Oh my god. This cutscene is so long. And now... All we have to do is use Tarn's Diary on all of our salve amulets, and they should all be salve amulet ease. So that should be really good for 83. Devoted to Dragon Slayer, you've served me well, kind of. Devoted three Undead Slayer, you are my new best friend. And now it's gaming time. Alrighty. First Crassian kill. Done and dusted. I thought that was 15 Blackstone Hearts. I was about to say, that's insane. 52. Okay, not bad. That was a really, really good Terracid kill. I had a lot of fun. And I didn't use a ton of food either, so I think we got a good strap for it. Oh my god. Go. Go, 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 go. No way I got it. <laughs> What's that? 457. Okay, by the way, for people on YouTube that are wondering why I'm, I'm hyped, um... There's a thing on Twitch called channel points that you get and you can gamble them on stream. They're like worthless. They don't have any value. Um, and the over under on my first ambi was five minutes and we clutched out a 457. So everybody that believed in me gets rich and everybody that didn't gets nothing but sadness. 83% of people didn't think I'd be able to do it. 83%. Oh my God. Not a single Blackstone Heart for the first run. All right, boys. Great start. Great freaking start. We're going to be here for a while, I think. 
Let's get our luck of the dwarves on. And what is our second ambassador drop going to be? Got Blackstone arrow tips. Um, does that mean we didn't get Blackstone hearts? We did not. So I believe we'll check our chest, but I'm pretty sure we've done two full runs now without a singular Blackstone heart. And yeah, I don't have a single Blackstone heart. <laughs> oh, no. Alrighty, Terrakit. That was awful. What do you got for me? I got a Blackstone heart. Let's go. My first ever Blackstone heart. I'm so glad. You're banning the word spinner. All right. We're going to call them... Um, what are those vacuums? We're going to call them Roombas. From here on out, from this point forward. You're banning the word Roomba. We're going to call them... Automatic Programmable Robot Vacuum Cleaner Robotic Auto Home. Okay. Goodbye. Oh my god, I saw 18, I saw Blackstone, and like each word I'm just like getting a little higher up on my chair, and then I saw arrow tips. Hate to see it. I couldn't teleport either, and then gone! So sad. That's what I'm gonna look like whenever you guys redeem this cell. Just let you guys know that. And then I cried. I cried. I did. Did I cry? wait? <clears throat> yes. Uh, See, so yeah, I just wanted to. Am I crying? Ugh, I can't believe it. But that's basically my bank. Um, that's really not good at all. I'm. But look, the important thing is we built ourselves back up. That's. It's not about the fall. It's about how you pick yourself up again at the end of it. And we did that. Here we go. Welcome to my first ever PVMing. The road to rebuild. How's it going guys? It's Ryan here and welcome to something a little Why this was the first PVMing I did? Different. Uh, Not so a clue. Episode number one of I darocked Bandos. How long did this re- I died? How long did this rebuild take? I'm wearing full superior Tetsu. Humble beginnings, boys. Humble beginnings. Anyway, let's go kill the ambassador. The final Ambi kill of the day. What do you got for me? Probably nothing. Would be my... But maybe it'll be something. Tune in. Find out. It was arrow tips. Okay. Uh, um, I have a very quick demo before we get into anything. Um, I have in my possession a completely normal mug um, that is completely normal. That I received in the mail from Kochi. Um, it's a very normal mug. Now, there's nothing in the mug as of as of right now, as you can as you can tell. Um, but it isn't perfect. So I'm gonna I'm gonna put some warm water into the mug here, and then um, if I spill it, I'm going to literally burn. There we go. A little bit of warm water. Okay. Cool. Got some warm water in the mug, and um, and interestingly, and in, uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh Great. Thank you, Kochi, for the for the great for the great great mug. Um, it, that says the the wide guy, and that's my face. That's my my own fit. On an unrelated note, I am looking for a new editor. Something happened to my old editor, um, and they are no longer employed by the RS Guy Productions. I'm gonna feel kind of weird about it if it's a PR. I'm not gonna lie. We got ourselves four. Oh, it is a PR, and four Blackstone Hearts as well. Blackstone Hearts, maybe. We did. We got a Blackstone Heart. Sweet. That's really good. Let's get it. Uh, that is. Ooh, a hundred Hydrix Bolt Tips actually. 
Later on down the line, that'll be like a half a phase of a Solak kill we can do. Oh, got Black Star Heart. Let's go. Actually huge. It's my 10th Crassian kill as well. And that is the end of the kill. What do you got for me, boss? Four more Black Star Hearts. That's actually really good. We're doing super, super well today. To level 26, we're actually over a quarter of the way there. All right, Advisor Grim, show me the Catentines. Wait, that's so pug. 196. We're gonna make like 200 overloads. I put a vial of water in my invent. I can one-click it, which is actually really cool. Wait. Were they trolling? And we kill number 11. What do you got for me? Five Blast and Hearts. That's actually really sick. That's a really, really good drop. We now have a total of 31. We've got a Blackstone Heart, level 88 Dungeoneering, and a 243 Terracut kill. That's actually really solid. For the PR? What do you got for me, MB? 454 and five more Blackstone Hearts. That's actually beautiful. I am super happy with that. Wait, you guys don't understand how PUF works. If you want me to make a guide, I can, but it's it's very, very simple. When your brain is the size of mine, it's as simple as you plant the dinosaurs, you water them with food, and then they grow, and that's it. Today is the Eldritch Day. We've done 13 solo runs. I'm clearly very dry. It's time. Um, Okay, I saw the pop-ups and I was like, that's gotta be an Eldritch piece. It is not, it is in fact a daily challenge, as well as four Blast Hearts, which I'm actually really good with. On to the next one. All righty, what do you got for me, Ambi? Anything? Five more Blast Hearts, let's go. That's actually really sick. So we're over 50 now. On to the next run. What? 17,000? Yeah, all right, well, doesn't really help a ton, but cargo Crocs? Wait. What are cargo crocs? That... That can't be a thing. It can't be. Imagine rolling up to a job interview. Imagine. Look at the texturing. That's fire. That's... I take it back. That's straight fire. If I ever open a P.O. box, I had better receive cargo crocs from one of you. I will... I will literally rock them. I will wear them to RuneFest. I think he's shorter than me. Oh, he's the same height as me. <laughs> he's the same height. Bro. Yeah, no, you, I, I'm it. I'm, I am the shortest tyrant. 100% lock it in. Reddit gets angry about literally everything. They could move a tree in Lumbridge and someone would make like a, a 10 paragraph long post about how they met their, the love of their life under that tree. And now they can't even bring themselves to log in anymore. No shot Reddit isn't angry. That is a successful kill. What do you got for me, boss? Uh, woo! A hundred hydrox pull tips and five blacks and hearts as well. Cool. I know the outfit will eventually pay for itself, but right this second, I'm going to be doing a lot of EDs anyway. I'd rather have this right from the get-go. Done. I mean, magic is going to make a comeback. And, it, and if absolutely necessary, if absolutely necessary, you can just become the one mage Brit on your Solak team that just keeps everything debuffed. And then the second it's not debuffed for four seconds, you get kicked from the team. That is what I see in your future. He doesn't die. He completes the kill. He gets the ghostly acid. Okay. Wait, what? That was like, wait, that was like a humidity flame wall. I'm doing it again. Okay, that one didn't work. The, the first one worked though. That first one did not hit me at all. That was sick. <laughs> oh my God. Actually, this has been like the best, the best seahorse phase of my life. No near death experiences. You know what? I would do that again. Oh God. I... Oh, actually loot really quick. One second. Um, five blocks and heart. Sweet. That's actually... Wait, we got ten. Wait, are we done? We're, we're almost done now. 
So we need six more blocks and hearts to technically be done. Although there's a chance I want to go back for another 100. I haven't decided yet. Do we win? Um, five blocks and hearts. So we are sitting on 97 out of the 100 we need. So I guess we're, uh, guess we're going back. Guess we're not, uh, not free. Why would you execute your plan? If you execute it, you're going to need a new one. Um, yeah, it's, it's actually the milk content. So you come up with a good plan. You just, you execute it publicly. A public execution in front of Twitch chat. And then you have to develop a new one. It's kind of five head, because then I get infinite content I can farm. Ooh, two Blackstone Hearts. So I believe I have 99 Blackstone Hearts. So this Reaper, four Ambi kills we have right now, that's going to be the the 100, like almost guaranteed. It would take an unprecedented streak of bad luck to uh, to not get that done there. I cut my own hair like a couple weeks ago. Felt like I did an okay job. Hairdressers closed, right? Because there is, there is a pandemic going on here in Canada, at least. So I cut my hair, right? Do it myself. Um, I was feeling pretty good about it. On three separate occasions, my dad mentioned to me, Hey, Ryan, did you know you're allowed to book a haircut now? So in 31 runs, we made 113 mil, except I think the values are probably off. But we've got eight rare relics, a bunch of salvage, some water tallies, not great. 400 roughly onyx bull tips, 400 hydrox bull tips. Won't be using those for a very long time. 97 blackstone hearts plus the five that I got banked from when I untoggled my chest for one kill. 1200 blackstone arrow tips, some ghostly essence, which isn't actually bad to have. I'm honestly pretty good at that. And then um, light, uh, sorry, dark animal stone spirits, decent. Outside of that, it's just eight-ish onyxes, and yeah, it's kind of the whole rundown. I'm uh, I'm pretty good at that. Um, so yeah, that kind of step of the journey is done. I'm gonna claim all of those Blackstone Hearts, and just like that, we've got uh, just over 100, 102 total. I would say an absolute success. We've done very well in ED3. We've made 100 million coins, um, and it's pretty much pure alkyls as well. I'm super, super good with that. We just, we gotta figure out what the, uh, what the next step of the plan is.